Kiara, uh, now we could make the same picture, but with all of you. All well, may know, so we have the example to go to the end of the of a, a banking transformation, it's called banking transformation model. The model is based on a, a product life cycle uh, combined with the approach uh, innovative groups and modified uh, by retail banking process models concerning payment, deposit and loan processes which are analyzed to five stages uh, process models. And, and those are formulated by me. I think this is a main, a main contribution of my work. Thank you, Rasmus. The model predicts and explains the uh, transformation how fast the main processes are transforming from the branches to the online banking channels. And it's quite accurate, and, and uh, uh, it's, uh, to my knowledge, uh, first in the world that this, this combination is made to uh, explain and develop the topic That level of development in, in finance. Yes. yes. Uh, all those uh, retail banking processes which are done at the branches at the moment, payment process, which is uh, mostly developed and for example in Finland only 5% of bills are transferred and paid at the branches, 60% goes online channels. The same will happen to deposit making and same will last happen to finance and loan process also. For example, student loans in Finland, 80% of those already applications are made online channels and uh, because uh, loan amounts 20% of uh, household applications are done through online channels already in Finland. US leads this uh, already 2001, 1.5 million uh, uh, applications of loans were made online in the US. Interesting. What would be the key issues of the model of transformation that you are proposing? Yeah. Key issue is, is, is how, how we people behave. 2.5% uh, of us are innovators who easily uh, uh, are interested about new technological innovations and, and start to use them. And, and Rogers has uh, uh, identified those five groups of, of uh, person behaving. And how can we relations? Here you have your diploma. Okay, just one, I want to say one a uh, few words as well. Uh, first, I want to congratulate Mr. Vesa uh, for the excellent work. It's not always useful that the thesis always uh, provides something new. Many times the thesis is just a remake of many other uh, something new, mostly in a field that is usually quite uh, hard to, uh, to really innovate. So I want to congratulate you for the work and I want to of course welcome you and congratulate you for being a doctor graduate from the university as well. Thank you very much for coming. Thank you very much. And Thank you very much for coming, that uh, you are showing a great friendship and respect uh, to your friend and partner, Mr. Vesa. Thank you. Thank you very much. It's my privilege to express the overwhelming gratitude <coughs> of your university. It's a very educational and, and, and very developed approach to distance learning method which you give. And I think the future will look very good for Persian International University. Thank you. You're welcome.